Roses and chocolates are all the rage, but you don't want flowers that are beige. Red and pink are in this season, but the colors don't have to have a reason. I would just say send the, send the flower that you think is the most beautiful to you. And don't worry about what the flowers signify as far as color is concerned. They all signify that you care for the person, so that's what I would go with. Love and passion is in the air, so you can send your love a teddy bear. When the delivery man sets the scene, all your co-workers will see green. Some people try to hide, yeah, embarrassed a little bit. Some people are all excited. A lot of times the people in the office is more excited than the recipient is because somebody's got something, you know, it's pretty cool. Roses are red, violets are blue, I've got flowers, how about you? The flowers are about the moment, you know, the impact, that, that great smile and hug that you're going to get after you give the flowers. So you want to give the flowers and then expect to have something in return as far as a nice big hug and a kiss type of thing. When you get flowers, make sure to put them in water because you don't want wilting on those flowers you bought her. There's many options depending on what you want to pay to make your love smile on this Valentine's Day.